hey everybody welcome back to my channel thank you guys so much for being here please go ahead and subscribe and turn your notification bell on so you do not miss any uploads yes the channel has been revamped you guys did not watch phlebotomy after dark this past phlebotomy after dark i think it's the only one up right now please go ahead and check it out so that you will know why things are missing why things are looking different the whole nine but i'm so glad you're here we've got so much more content to put up because of what i discussed saturday so please check that video out so that you'll be in the loop but nonetheless turn your notification bell on so you don't miss out on anything i am going to discuss serum tubes versus plasma tubes today yes i hope you guys are ready and excited about that and that's what we're going to do we're just going to jump into these videos and you know get the party started so to speak and phlebotomy videos well videos period are going to be uploaded now yes i have a schedule because a lot of people ask when and what time videos will go up on mondays wednesdays and fridays and then on the weekends you know it's all hands on deck we'll do whatever we'll do still do phlebotomy after dark which will still be held on saturdays but i don't think we're going to get them up every saturday but we will get them up so we're talking about our green light green top tube and our gold top tube or our serum separator tubes and we know there's a family of those and we'll get into that in videos to come so in talking about the gold top tube and your light green top tube i want to first let you guys know and some of you i'm sure know this this of course is your serum separator tube and it produces serum hence the name serum separator your light green top tube is a tube that's going to produce plasma yes now both of these tubes can go to chemistry and we've discussed that and we've talked about why and and all the differences and the reasons serum versus plasma how do we get it what does it mean all of that so our serum separator tubes okay which is our gold top tubes we centrifuge clotted blood right so the gel helps the blood to clot then we centrifuge it and we get serum okay when we collect a light green top tube we are centrifuging whole blood right clotted blood because it clots this is whole blood with an anticoagulant the lithium heparin is an anticoagulant that's why when you draw a light green top tube the blood does not clot because that the additive is preventing it from clotting we keep the whole blood and when it's centrifuge we get plasma okay you got y'all got that i need you to get that i need you to understand that now once we've got them centrifuge once they've been centrifuged and you're like okay so okay <laughs> now what now comes why can you use a green top in place of a gold or a gold in place of a light green well the only time you can do that is when it's going to produce diagnostic results like diagnostic testing like the chemistry levels we've all we always discuss so that's why a lot of you will say oh we use gold and so oh we use the light green that's why because you're using them for chemistries now in the event that we need to produce um, antibodies we need you know this this did this these results are going to deal with our immune system and i've told you guys this that's when we need our gold top tubes because it's producing serum that's where our antibodies are our antibodies we're we're not going to use our light green top for that because remember it's mostly for diagnostic testing we have plasma here we're not going to use that for our antibodies and for testing test for to determine what's going on with our immune system so just remember that and um i wanted to also mention that some places and labs will also use a light green top for uh blood transfusions and, and things of that nature so just remember your plasma versus your serum why it's important to know the difference between the two and why it's okay in certain instances for them to be used in when i don't have one but i have the other so i'm upstairs and i need you know chemistry testing but i only have a light green top you can do that 
I'm upstairs and I need chemistries, but I, I only have the gold top. I don't have a light green. You can do that because remember, diagnostic testings, yes, chemistries and those sort of things, pretty much that's it. Your chemistry levels can be determined and these tubes can be used for that. I really just wanted to throw that out there because we never really discuss plasma versus serum and that whole nine. So thumbs up, share, like, comment. Let me know what you think in the comment section, please. Let's be more interactive with these videos so that I know what to bring you and you guys let me know. Because as you know, we got hardly nothing on the channel because of the changes, which is good because the channel was saturated with a lot of content, old content. So we can make that content new again because we have so many new family members and so many of you are going to school, coming out of school, looking for jobs so we can start fresh. And I, I actually like that. And I hope you guys like that. So thumbs up. Let me know if you like it and let me know if there's anything you need me to discuss or want me to discuss books phlebotomy essentials anything that you're looking for please click the link down below i only have one link up now it'll take you to everything if you're looking whatever you're looking for anything that i discuss whether it be about phlebotomy or when we're talking about books in general or just anything the link is down below go ahead and click that and you'll find exactly what you need so yes thank you guys so much for being here and i look forward to seeing y'all in the next video remember monday wednesdays and fridays we're here See y'all later. Bye.